we live in an environment of actual and potential gift. When we encounter a new person, a new situation, the question we must ask is, what is the gift waiting to be given here? What is it that will enrich me in unexpected ways, not enrich me according to my agenda, but open up a new kind of relationship? And if you have this basic conviction that everything that is, so to speak, crystallizes the self-communication of the divine in some way, then obviously there's, there's gift all around. And that's not, um, I hope, to make a sort of sentimental observation that it's all wonderful, it's all lovely, and um, sort of words worthy an idea that one impulse from a vernal brook can teach us more of man than all the sages can, or whatever the, uh, um, the verse is. It's simply to say, we are so constituted that we ourselves as heart, soul, and body all together are already attuned to a world of intelligence and body all mingled together. We grow as human beings when we, we are most open, most receptive to that, that world around us because we're not strangers in it. So a story that reminds us that we're not strangers a story that reminds us that what's around us has a dimension always out of sight, but always nourishing us sort of underground. That's, that's something of what we need in our, our narratives.